this this will go with you for at least five to six months or maybe more in fact depending on your usage so it's never bad to invest in a good mascara best part about this mascara is look at this so this is okay this is the black side of it so there is a primer which comes with this mascara which is like this white primer so what i do is that i just apply this white primer on my eyelashes yeah now once you have applied the white one you will go for the black one and do this You see the difference in my eyes? Like without mascara, with mascara. So the mascara really makes a lot of difference. If you will ask me to choose between liners and mascara, I will always go for a mascara. Though I know that I've got really bad eyelashes, like this up. Oh, see? So your eyes look really different with a lash of mascara. So um, if you ask me, how should you really apply the mascara so that it doesn't screw up? It's very simple. Just uh, always close your eyes like that. Like, you know, in lower motions, just do doom. Don't do this. Don't don't use your mascara like going upward. Try to do with your eyes, and I think that was pretty. And also, if you will see, most of uh, the hair on your mascara never goes in one direction. So you can see the difference. So you see, there's a lot of difference between the side and the side. Okay, and of course, they look uh, bigger. And uh, yeah, if you ask me, I have tried a lot of mascaras from Max and AK. A lot of other L'Oreal products or Maybelline mascara, but I think till date this one has been the best. Also, there was this uh, Maybelline Fiber mascara. That one also was a really good one that I've used. But the only problem with that was because the fiber sometimes to go into my eyes, my eyes to turn red. So yeah, I think this is better because uh, the thing in it is like more creamy. So guys, just like um, uh, eyeliner would make a lot of difference to your eyes, so does a little bit of mascara. I mean. I would always prefer a mascara over a liner because sometimes the eyeliner can make you look um, older. So that's why the mascara is good. Okay, so now we've done this, done, 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 it's done. Now, comes to the cheeks and now we'll go through it. So you guys have seen it in most of um, my videos before as well. I've been talking about this thing. This product is from the body shop. It's 6.95 rupees. But I would want to tell you one thing, guys. This product goes out of stock like this because it's a really nice product. You can get one from Benetint and uh, either of the key places, and also there are so many products like for the you know for the skin uh, for the cheek tint. Um, I have used Benetint as well, but it's more watery based and it just goes off. And also, it's very difficult to dab and create that look. But with this. This has been like one of my favorites. If you don't even want to apply makeup, you can use this even without makeup. So anybody who has really clear skin and doesn't have anything on their skin, don't want to apply makeup, just go with the mascara and go with this tint. And I think, okay, so I'll just tell you how to apply it. So you go in circular motions, and as soon as you're done, just spread it like this, okay, with your fingers. See? So you see how it looks no i don't have it so so as you can see i have it here and i don't have it here so this is a lot of so this and also just to make it look because it's winters now just to make it look more cuter and everything i put it on my nose as well so it looks like as if my nose is red <laughs> i like it and um, see it's very small just like cool. So you just see the side of my face and that's the side. So this side looks more dull and this looks better. So, so when it comes to the lips, there are like thousands and millions of lipsticks on the market. 
and sometimes you know and there's so many things to choose between like matte non-matte lip glossy sometimes you just get confused okay there's so many things but point is a lipstick is a lipstick it's a tint that's gonna be there so it doesn't really matter all it matters is that it should look nice and it should stay um, well now, when you're coming to the affordable section, if you can spend around 300, 400, then you can go for the Lacme color bar for 700. Other ones for like a Maybelline will cost you the same money like Matte Lacme. But now we're talking like really affordable. So, this, uh, this is color bar. Sorry, this is uh, LA18. And so I have to, I've got two shades. And I've used this lipsticks. Uh, at first I thought, yeah, the board says, hey, will this even be good or stay? It does. I mean, let's say it's not going to stay the whole day. Maybe you'll have to reapply it every four or five hours. But I think it's okay, right? So, so this is Colourpop's Matte from NA18. So it's only 100 bucks. So I've got this for like 200 bucks. So I've got this shade for the night or let's say if you want something by nude uh, then you can go for this one. Let me show you which shade is this. It's called Pink Berry. I don't know how, it, how does it look pink but it's Pink Berry. So you can see the shade. It's a little mummy wala shade but it's good you know. And the second one, okay I really like this one. This is called Pink Berry again. This is weird. Okay. So both of them actually have the same name, but they're different colors. Okay. Maybe something went wrong with this. <laughs> but the lipsticks are good. But uh, so rather than going on the streets and buying those stuffs, it's better you buy something more authentic and original. And I think it's worth it. So I will right now on my lips use the pink one. No, they have the same names. So this is. Mm -hmm. What's the trick to apply a lipstick? Nothing. Huh. Because this color is like really dark, you know? Like, right? copy. Hmm. So you see the tint? Not bad at all. And yeah, one more thing I have to tell you guys. Though this is matte. Yeah, it looks matte, but it doesn't dry up your skin. I mean, sorry, your lips. This is something which is very important. So I think I'm uh, quite much done with my makeup, but if I want the more glowy look and whatever, I can still use my Almanol, but I don't want it. I think I'm done and dusted. So this is it. We're done. Did I forget anything? Please do let me know in the comments below. So, yeah, yeah. If you like this video, please don't forget to share it on your stories. And just let me know what did you like about this video. Also, let me know what is the next thing that you're waiting for. I know you're gonna say the video for the scars and the marks. I will. But you know what? I'm shooting it every day because I really want y'all to see the progression. So, for every one of you guys who have not bought the Lumi White Cream, I need to see it, right? So, it's gonna take a little time. Not a lot of time. Mostly yay, happy or the next I don't know but um, yeah that will be my episode 6 so this was my episode 5 and I hope you guys like it and uh, I am going to add all the products with their prizes even in the caption so just in case if you miss it out in the videos you can just see it so I'll add the products not the prizes haha <laughs> okay so bye until next time I will see you guys bye pandas